This piece of heavy machinery was explaining his daily road trips through New Rochelle to get coffee, cigarettes, and play numbers at a local convenience store, driving the one-mile round trip from the yard debris transfer station where he works multiple times a day, according to local residents who didn't want to be identified. How many times a day? At least three. At least three, sometimes it's four or five, depending on his mood, I guess. Not that anyone begrudges a working man his coffee and cigarettes, but we're talking about a big construction machine here. City Hall has gotten complaints about him driving it around, and the operator himself says he has no choice. We caught up with him on one of his scheduled breaks. The big ride parked outside. Budget cuts left the driver working alone at the unsecured transfer lot. The city of New Rochelle decided to have him drive the big machine from the main garage to the lot and then use it for coffee runs and bathroom breaks during his workday. This thing is driving up and down public streets and the liability that Nurshell takes by just having that thing roaming around for no good purpose other than to go get coffee just really bothers me. I mean, it's not the safest thing in the world, is it? No. Yeah. Have you talked to them about it? Yes. They don't want to leave the machine down there because it gets vandalized down there. That could be changing soon. The new Rochelle Public Works Commissioner admits the big wheel coffee runs are, quote, not an optimal situation and that we are trying to rectify that. We'll keep you posted. In New Rochelle, Lou Young, CBS2 News.